Good afternoon, YouTubers, and welcome to the Kevin T Channel. Yes, for the daily vlog. Not the daily vlog, the daily log, the daily fog, the daily vlog. So, today I've had an interesting day. Uh, I found an app called uh, Dub Smash, where you basically record yourself lip syncing to almost anything. Lyrics, uh, quotes, music, whatever. So, anyhow, but that's not my main topic of discussion today. Today is going to be history. Alright, now, I came across some information that I didn't even know, or I may have known at one point, or I may have heard it at one point, that the actor who played Uncle Remus in Song of the South did not even get a chance to visit or go to the uh, actual showing, the opening ceremonies for that movie in the 1930s because no hotel would book him. They would not make any reservations for him and so forth. So he was not able to see the actual final product of that film. Now that tells me something a little bit about history that you can say, oh well, they'll boycott the film for this and that and this and that, political reasons. But here's the thing. Unless you understand the knowledge and history of what the African Americans have gone through in the last 200 years, don't argue. <laughs> I've, you know, seen movies, I've seen books on the subject, okay? It, you can't erase history, okay? You cannot erase history. You can't erase Americans owning slaves back in the 1860s. Before that, in the 1800s. Before that, in the 1700s. Before that, in the 1600s. Okay? They tried it with the American, uh, Native American population. That didn't work. Mutiny on the Bounty was... Uh, all that needed to be said about that one. They tried it when they first tried to colonize the uh, North American continent. Didn't exactly work. <laughs> but, here's the thing. And I think I may or may not be on the right road, but that's okay. I can maneuver around for a while. Um... You can't erase the past. There are some people out there that I've seen on Facebook trying to post stuff saying they want to eradicate all of the Confederate statues and all this because it's a bad part of the South. Well, you can't exactly do that. You know, because it is a part of history. And as we all know, history, you cannot you know, forget. I mean, you don't forget 9-11. That's history. It's world history, as a matter of fact. Uh, you can't forget Pearl Harbor. Pearl Harbor happened to be one of the most infinite events in history. It is well known that the Japanese bombed Pearl Harbor on December 7th, 1941. At approximately 8 o'clock in the morning. Don't give me exact specifics, but Let's just put it this way. The Pacific Fleet, Pacific Fleet took a heavy casualty loss. I mean, hence the reason you have an Arizona Memorial. It's history. You can't eradicate it. You can't try and change it. And you can't try and forget it. I mean, the Declaration of Independence was signed on July 4th, 1776. That's a fact. That's history. You cannot change history. The simple fact that we are trying to... That some people out there don't want certain facts in history to show up or to be allowed to be seen is ridiculous. Because it happened. You can't avoid it. Avoiding history 
avoids future events. It's like trying to avoid your own death. It's going to happen eventually. It's just you don't know when. <laughs> Unless you get into, you know, a weird premonition, but that's just out there in left field somewhere. There's things out there that, you know, you can't change. I can't change my past. It's a part of my history. I can't change the way things are. I can only, one can only hope you can change the future, but that's another story entirely. It's just... Why a certain company won't allow this film to be out there is beyond reason. It's a part of history. And avoiding what was done in history just makes things worse. Trying to forget it on an individual basis, that's one thing. Trying to forget it altogether, that's another. So that's my story and I'll be trying to bring you some history events and so forth that I'll find or whatever in the online and whatnot for the next uh, try and get some episodes going and so forth of history and I'll look at it and try and tell you about it and what's happened and discuss it and a, my opinion on it at least again my opinion which there are millions of opinions yes millions of opinions and only one could be fact okay so that's for the daily blog daily vlog today and thanks for watching and please subscribe to my channel